Hello everyone, we are the, the Nobodies. Nobodies. What are we doing here today? Well, today we are actually amazed that we're doing a video. That's crazy. It's crazy. It's been so long. Like, I think we've been on, almost away for a month now. Uh, yeah. That probably sounds about right. We apologize. Yeah. Uh, between school, work, life. You know, He's going to work in like an hour. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So it's like, you know, he comes home and I go to work and it's been around the clock and the holidays and everything's coming up. So uh, anyway, uh, we finally, we're getting one in. It's uh, what, December 2nd, yeah. 2019. So uh, yeah, interesting. Happy holidays, you know, whatever holiday you celebrate. Of course. And uh, being whatever holiday you celebrate, we're going to play a video from a band called Prophets of Rage. Can I say the name title? No. Oh. Can but you? <laughs> they could say it inside the song. Ah, yes, of course. Yes. And on you heck, can write it, though. Unheck the World. By no, no, no. <laughs> Unheck no. the World by Prophets of Rage. On the... Star, so, exclamation what, point. What did you say? Tic-tac-toe. I, I, I don't know uh, symbols. So okay, I don't know. I, you know, I don't know. Anyway, um, <laughs> so this is another one of, uh, I hear this band is a super group. Mm. I think it, uh, it's Tom Morello from Rage Against the Machine, who's mm. the bassist. All right. Uh, you have Chuck D from Public Enemy, and I think uh, Be Real from Cypress Hill. Hmm. And from what I heard through the grapevine, that they are uh, very anti-government. So I don't know if uh, the song is going to be against our president now, or if it's just presidents in general. Uh, I guess we'll find out within the uh, within the group. But uh, I'm telling you right now, whatever the song is, we have no opinion on political anything. So, uh, we're just here to watch, listen, and react to the song. Let's just agree that all politicians suck. Alright, I'm son. Yes, and I'm father. Controversy time. Controversy time. Now you can stop it now. All right, I've only seen about 30 seconds of the video and I'm assuming that this is an anti-Trump video. Yeah. I But I don't know, I've just seen Trump a lot. So, um, listen, it can change it. It can change, it can change. But uh, you know, in the beginning they were showing, uh, you know, we used to do it in school all the time back in the uh, 80s, you know, how we used to hide under the desk for a nuclear blast or you know, I don't know if they still do that in your we school. We had a shelter drill the other day, actually. Yeah, because uh, like hiding the, under a desk is going to stop a nuclear bomb from coming into the room. Oh, man, it was really funny. We, we've we all started <laughs> having to wear, like, school IDs recently. It was like, how could the tornado even get in? It doesn't have an ID. Exactly. <laughs> like, nu oh, you know what, nuclear bomb? We're going to skip this school. Everyone's under their desk. <laughs> but uh, you could see that uh, they would, you know, they had uh, prescription... Uh, prescription like cartoons and everything so I'm assuming uh, you know they're uh, unhappy with the pharmaceutical companies which maybe you know, it's a healthcare thing and everything yeah. but you know there's problems everywhere you know, just uh, you know pharmaceutical companies they just you know definitely are very 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 uh, expensive yeah that's about right
Uh, that's not. No, the groove kicks ass. Yeah, no. I'm getting, um. Can't even remember the band's name, but it's freaking. That one, that one very well-known rap song. Like I don't know why it doesn't even matter how hard you try. Like that, I'm getting very that kind of vibes. Oh, okay. Well, all I know is that it definitely has uh, the Rage Against the Machine feel, which we Absolutely. haven't done on this uh, page yet. But I know you know them. Yeah. Um, but yes, be real. He's tearing it up right now. Oh, he's now. killing it. I can see in the video, you know, they're talking about just everything that's going on between protests and, you know, because uh, God knows that right now we are the divided states of America, no matter what side you, uh, you know, your political views are. Yeah. Um, but, you know, that's that's not just under this administration or the last administration or the administration before that. This has been going on since humans were born. Not born, but since humans became, because you know it's it's humans suck. Yeah, that's about you know. Right. Everybody has an opinion. Everybody you know has a different view. Everybody has a different policy, and somebody is not gonna like it. Period. Even if it's the best idea in the world. Yeah. All right. Let's keep going. Right before this sad part happens. Hmm. Um, before the melodic part? Yeah, before the melodic part. Uh, one part specifically made it clear this is an anti-Trump video. Oh, absolutely. I can just tell that. Here's the thing, I don't know what to say without starting any sort of war, because I said, like I said earlier, controversy. No, you could definitely tell it's an anti-Trump video, whether you like him or not. Um, yeah, absolutely. You know... Uh, Music wise, though, he, he, they, they keep showing song. pictures of Trump. It's just you know, even if you didn't get anything from the video, uh, you know, they they in the meat grinder they put the Constitution, they put guns. You know, they put the guns in the you know in the in the garbage bin. They you know basically they're saying no guns. You know, so you could tell they definitely have uh, demo Democrat views. Yeah, it's more Democratic views. Yeah, no, well, no, that we're all the United States is I, a democratic. I nation. Did. It's Democrat and Republican. I. It's not Democratic. Then not, I don't think it is. No, they're not the Democratic Party. They are the Democrat Party. Uh -huh. We are all Democratic. Okay. We are a republic. Per se. Okay. Never mind. I'm not even gonna get into that one. Um. Music is great, though. Music is great, you know. Um, if they would just, uh, I think, um, what's the word I'm looking for? They have a totally, totally, totally 
Rage Against the Machine. It, it, like, whatever super group they're trying to, you know, personify, they're doing a great job. Absolutely. Uh, they got the groove of Cypress Hill. They got the groove of, uh, you know, Be Real. He's in there, you know, like I said, from uh, Public Enemy. The groove is great. The choruses are great. Um, you know, it's just who's going to listen to it. You know, it, it basically with a song like this... Yeah, because it said in it said in there, you know, all oh, the people got to stand up. Basically, he's like calling out for a revolution. You know what I mean? So uh, yeah, he, they got one type of crap against the current state of government. Yeah, whatever. You know, he it said in there, you know, they showed all the presidents. It wasn't just Trump. They just showed Trump a lot, but they did show Obama. They showed Bush. They showed you know they showed the line of presidents. You know because. Yeah, I think the prime thing I noticed it with, though, personally, for me, was how they showed a picture of a bunch of known, very radicalist leaders in history. Okay. And then it ended off with Trump. That was the specific thing I noticed. Oh, it did. I didn't even notice that. Oh, no, that was the... I saw it, I was like, oh, man, look at all these is. And then Trump was at the end, I was like, oh, okay, gotcha. Yeah, we get it now. <laughs> oh, whatever. You know, like I said, if, if they're happy with only making money on... One group, God hey, bless them. Because I, 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 you know, I'm a true believer that a mu music music should stay out of politics. That's I, fair. you know, I believe music. You know, if we go to mu to to see concerts, personally me, because the world is full of politics. The world is full of this. You know, problems. You know, family a accidents, just just everything. Yeah, at the end of the day, you go, suck. you go to an entertainment you, event to be to, entertained. To be entertained and forget about all life. You concentrate. You got an hour of your life that you're going to see a band that you love so much because you just want to forget everything in the world. And then you got a band sitting there preaching about something, and you're just like, oh. I've heard this a thousand times on the news today. Why do I got to listen to this shit again for another hour? You know what I mean? And that's, like I said... It's the same for everything. Yeah, exactly. I don't care if you're sitting there the whole time going, Trump rules, Trump rules, Trump rules, Trump rules. Or, and then the guy next, you know, the next concert's like, Dude, freaking Obama sucks, Obama sucks, Obama sucks. And it's like, I don't want to hear it. Yeah. Talk, talk about freaking, you know... Sex, drugs, and rock and roll. I don't want to hear it. I've been I, at work. I've literally had dollar bills with Make America Great Again printed on them. And I'm like, okay, what was the reason for that? Exactly. There was literally no reason to do that other than maybe making a point, I guess. Yeah, what point? Yeah, what point? Like, but music is not for that. Music is for freaking to... to, to to it's stupid get to... people out of depression, to get uh, the spirit awoken... You know, you just want five minutes to forget about life. It's stupid to put politics into something that clearly wasn't... Intended for it? Intended for it. Like, I doubt back in the day people made music. Back in the day, like, Great Depression is when African-American music freaking strived. Yeah, well, look at, look and, at the Beatles. They, you know, yeah, they the all made... Days, night, it's, you know, it's not, you know, they, I guess towards the middle of the Beatles revolution, they started talking politics, too. Yeah, I true. guess, I guess it's so, you know, every band has a little bit of something that they believe in, you know, country music, they're like, ah! And, uh, but, like, even then, Great Depression jazz was so popular because... They, it it they got, got it made people forget about the forget fact that they were the broke. That they were broke. A hundred percent. I agree. Anyway, let's keep going. That was it. All right. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> We really just delayed that video, <laughs> the end of that video, huh? All right, so we basically said everything we needed to say about politics. Even I, I, th I hope we stayed freaking unbiased enough, I think so. But song-wise... I didn't say anything about anything. Yeah. I just, <laughs> I just think that they shouldn't have, you know, put politics into music. I think their beat is great. Uh, I, I, my head was moving the whole time. It was know? a great song. You know, they, 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 it was a good song, you know? Would I... You know, personally, would like different lyrics. You know, it doesn't whether I like it or not. I could be a freaking Hillary supporter, and I wouldn't want to hear those lyrics. 
To I be could fair, be a Trump I think, supporter. I wouldn't want to hear those lyrics. I don't want to hear about politics in my music. To and be that's honest, just my personal opinion. Yeah, I get that. But honestly, with this song, I don't think the music, the lyrics themselves, were biased. The video it was just itself, the video yeah. they threw behind. No, the, the, if you listen to the lyrics, there were was, probably some points. If I'm saying, but if you listen to the lyrics, he was just saying the truth about basic shit that's that's happening. Yeah. Wasn't anything that's not happening. Pharmaceutical companies are, are expensive. Climate change, you know, you could argue whether or not that's real or not. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Everything that's going on is was in that song, you know, but it's all about if you agree on it or not. Yeah, I get you. All right, so... If you want to like, comment, and subscribe, tell us down in the comment section below what songs we should listen to because we take your requests. Press that subscribe button with the little bell next to it to get notified when we upload a video. Yeah, maybe a month from now. No, maybe a month from now. Who knows? We might upload a video next year. I, I doubt it. No, 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 no. No, we're good. Um, I'm son. And I'm father. Rock, Rock on. on.